want to show you how you can add an IP camera to your home center tree. This can be useful to if you have, for instance, a motion sensor and you want to automatically stream video or get the notification within the picture. What you do is you click on the wheel, you go to devices as you normally want and the device, and then you select instead of Z-Weave, you select other. Then you select the plus button on the top right, click on plus, you select IP camera. Then you choose your manufacturer. In my case, I have a DAWA camera, which is not supported in Home Center 3. So I have to select other, but try to find your maker of your camera in here, because that simplifies the, the setup procedure. In case you don't have it like I do, click on other. You select save, then the camera will, will be automatically be added. There's no configuration yet, so you have to set the configuration. You select advanced, then you <coughs> select the protocol type you want to use for the camera transmission, and that can be HTTP or HTTPS. Then, if in case you want to use only pictures, you connect the GPA, GPG uh, stream path. If you want to do a video, uh, you select the MPG path. In my case, I know this is the, the path for the video. You need to Google it on your um, for your specific camera what your uh, MPG stream path is. Then how you want to display it as picture or movie. I want movie. If your camera supports pan and tilt, you enter the information in here. Here you select the IP address. My case it's one nine six one two zero three. Then the port. You can also search it if you want to search your network. You can actually search the entire your entire network with all the connected devices uh, will be listed here. And you can just automatically select your uh, camera. In my case, I, this is the camera I'm connecting at the moment. So I select, select and it only gives the IP address. If it requires an IP and uh, if it requires an, uh, a username, you type it in here and you select save. Now the camera set up. Now you can view it. You go to the little eye here. Then the camera is created. You click on two arrows. And here you go. Here's the camera. And here you can um, add it to a scene or whatever you want to do. You just click on anyone and make a screenshot. Now it makes a picture you can see here. Screenshot is taken. And what you can do here is you can connect it to any room you want to do. In my case, I have a chicken house, so I connect it to my chicken house. And you can make a schedule on what you want to do with the, the, the camera. That's it. Enjoy.